Around Cleveland, brought to you by Spitzer Auto World. Our world revolves around you. Hi everyone, I'm Donna Ruco, and you're back on the list. Roses are red, violets are, well, you know the rest. It's time to get poetic. Here's Mike Brookbank with the three stories you're tweeting about around Cleveland. At number one, Poem in Your Pocket Day, would you like a poem? Warm up those vocal cords. Poem in Your Pocket Day is hitting the streets of Cleveland tomorrow. Poetry is fun and it's for everyone. The Cleveland Public Library will be handing out poems downtown around lunchtime, written by Ohio authors. Ohio is home to some very legendary poets, Langston Hughes, Nikki Giovanni, Paul Lawrence Dunbar. There will also be events going on inside the library. At number two, road trip. More out of towners might be making the trek to the Pro Football Hall of Fame in Canton this summer. Let's go, let's go, let's go. This after the Huffington Post names it, one of the tourist traps people are missing out on in each state. With road trip season fast approaching, get some ideas by checking out the complete list of tourist traps. I have a link on my Facebook page. At number three, crazy card throwing. There oh, man. From impressing the investors on ABC's Shark Tank to wowing his hometown crowd, Rick Smith Jr. is making a name for himself with a deck of cards. A playing card, one playing card. He's in the Guinness Book of World Records for sending a single card 216 feet at 92 miles per hour. I learned I could do this while I was playing baseball at Cleveland State University. That was 10 years ago. Now you can see him in Rally Alley with the rest of the performers during select Indians home games. These aren't enhanced, like, funny cards. They're just paper playing cards. Also look for Rick later this year on Stan Lee's Superhumans on the History Channel. Now you're caught up and clued in Around Cleveland. I'm Mike Brickbank. Around Cleveland, brought to you by Spitzer Auto World. Our world revolves around you.